All right, today we're doing another Vlogmas recipe. We are making some homemade divinity. Um, this is not my grandma's recipe, although she used to make divinity all the time. For some weird reason, it was not in her set of recipes. So we're gonna get over here to the stove and we're gonna get started. everybody welcome back to harvest moon farm my name is mickey and as i said we are going to make some divinity tonight in our saucepan we are going to add two and a half cups of sugar half a cup of water and a half a cup of light corn syrup. And, <clears throat> and an eighth of a teaspoon of salt. So we're gonna turn on some medium heat we're gonna let all this start melting down until the sugar is all dissolved. And once it starts to boil, we're gonna go ahead and put our candy thermometer on there. And we're gonna cook it until it reaches 260 degrees, which should take about eight to 10 minutes. So while this is cooking down, we're gonna go ahead and whip up some egg whites. Uh -oh. So we're gonna put two egg whites in our stand mixer. And we are going to whip this on high. Oh goodness, whip this on high using our whisk attachment. So we're going to let our egg white mix until it's forming some stiff peaks and then we're going to switch to our paddle attachment for the next step once our candy is has reached the right temperature. Sugar and syrup mixture is almost starting to come to a boil and as soon as it does we'll put our candy thermometer in there and then we'll just let it sit and we are not going to stir it until the temperature reaches 260. My grandma always made divinity during the holidays and sometimes she put pecans in it or walnuts I think. Um, but a lot of, but as kids, we wouldn't eat it if it had nuts in it. But um, when she made it plain, a lot of times she colored it red and green for the holiday. And my mom made divinity a few times, I believe. Um, I've tried it before, tried making it before, I guess I should say. It's been several years though, and so I thought this was a good year to try it again. All right, so our syrup is starting to boil. So I just put the thermometer in there and we're just going to let that cook now until it reaches 260 degrees. And it is at about 175 right now, so we have a little ways to go. 
going to my grandma's during the holidays and the buffet that I now have she would have set up in their dining room and the top was always covered with divinity and fudge and cookies and store-bought candies it was awesome all right we're getting close we're right at about 250 it's been about nine minutes and we are just about there Okay, there we go. So what we're going to do now is I've turned this heat off. I'm going to turn the mixer on high and we are going to pour this in a very thin stream into our egg whites while this beats on high. And it should take about two minutes to get all this poured. So I'm going to go ahead and set my timer for two minutes so that I can make sure that I'm gauging the speed that I'm pouring this in. Okay, so now we're going to get this scooped out as fast as we can because this sets up super fast. I've got these spoons sprayed with some vegetable spray. Okay, mine don't look pretty, but... My grandma's always looked so perfect. Come on, you. But like I said, she made it every year and I've only made it, oh, a few times. I said but once it starts um, once you start mixing it all in you also add some vanilla I will go ahead and link this recipe in the description box since it is not mine or my grandma's if you want any of my recipes <clears throat> If you sign up for my newsletter, you'll get five free recipes. And there's also a link in the description box where you can go to a site where you can purchase all of my recipes or my grandma's recipes um, for this season for just five dollars. Okay, so this piece is kind of, we'll kind of squish it together. All right. So these don't look like my grandma's, like I said, but they taste good. All right, so that is gonna do it for today's Vlogmas video. We've got this homemade, not super beautiful divinity, but it tastes amazing and that's the important part. So I wanna thank you guys for watching this video. I really appreciate it and make sure you keep your eye out for tomorrow's video as well. All right guys, thanks and have a great holiday season.